Hey everybody, Rick Needham, Andy Caffey, Thoroughbred Racing from my hometown track, Penn National Race Course in Granville, Pennsylvania. It is Thursday evening, July the 1st, and this is my day at the track.com race of the day. I'm going to focus on race 5 this evening, 8.08 p.m. Eastern Post Time. Six furlong sprint on the dirt track. Phillies and mares, three years old, and up race for a claiming purse of $21,000. Contenders number three, Lion in the Sun. Number two, Maria's Daughters. Number six, Yes, I Am American. And number four, Brilliant Response. Number three, Lion in the Sun is the overall speed leader. In this claiming field, springing at or about tonight's distance of six furlongs is nice overall speed to complement for this sprint. Comes off back-to-back -back power run wins in her last two starts. Jockey Oliver Castillo was in her iron, so those two wins is back tonight for his third ride, gunning for the hat trick. Number two, Maria's daughter, the pace profile leader. Her recent past performance sheet show a power run win in her second race back in a race which was contested at tonight's distance of six furlongs on the dirt. Race five summary, number three, Lion in the Sun, tops my contenders list, which also includes number two, Maria's Daughters, number six, Yes, I Am American, and number four, Brilliant Response, three, two, six, four, and the fifth tonight from Penn National. A couple of bonus long shots for you to consider, Finger Lakes in upstate New York, race four, six to one shot, number seven, Cherokee Gem, Drops in class by four units. The overall speed leader in this claiming field sprinting at today's distance is six furlongs on the dirt. Presque Isle Downs racing tonight, race five, number six, Maggie's Jewel, an eight to one shot. The speed leader in this claiming field sprinting at her about five and a half furlongs on their cushioned dirt track. So from Penn National on the Thursday night, Rick Needham for dayatthetrack.com, reminding you as always to please bet with your head, not over it.